And the images following Hurricane Ian have been heartbreaking to see. Here in Alabama, we are no strangers to storms, and we know that disasters can bring out the best in people, but it can also bring out the worst. Our friends at the Better Business Bureau want to remind you about how you can donate to causes safely. Joining us live over Zoom is Mondi Donaldson from the Better Business Bureau. Mondi, it's unfortunate that people want to take advantage of those who want to help. That's right, Sally. People have been through so much already, and then these scammers come and they scam the people that live there, and they scam the people who want to be generous and help them as well. Yeah, the scammers are always looking for a quick buck. If someone is looking to donate to storm victims, what are some things that they need to remember? Well, in a situation like this, you see a lot of crowdfunding sites pop up, and you see uh, all sorts of things on your email, on your social media, and on TV stations. Um, you see uh, messages coming at you all, all the time. So what you want to look for is a legitimate charity. You want to know where is your money going specifically? Is If you give to a, an entity, is it going for food? Is it going for shelter? Is it going to help for relocation? What is your gift going to? So we have a couple of things in place that we can help people if they want to come and find out more. Yeah, show us how folks can vet those charities to make sure they're legitimate. Yes, so you can go to give.org. That will give you, those are um, businesses and charities that have been approved by us. That means they've been in business for a long time. They are using what they say they're gonna use the money for, that's what the money's going for. So if you see something and you, you look like, it looks like maybe it's a social media message or a Facebook post and it just got created yesterday and there's no home address and there's no history behind that particular organization you better run the other way because there's so many good good ways to help. And you can go to the BBB.org and look at Get Wise Giving Alliance, or you could go to Give.org to find out what charities are approved by the BBB and look to see where that money is actually going and it is not going into the hands of scammers. And Monty, there are some fake charities out there. They look legitimate. The name looks like it, but it may have a, a misspelling. There may be just a little change in that web address. So it can be tricky. Yes, and tell the other, the other, there's two other things that scammers do. Sometimes they just take pictures, like they say, this is this is our neighborhood or this is our community, and those are pictures that were from two or three years ago from something, another hurricane or another disaster. Another thing sometimes people will do is set up GoFundMe um, fake accounts using a celebrity's name or some well-known person, and so people fall for that as well. So vet, vet your charity, check with us, um, if your church is doing a fundraiser and they're collecting items and going there, then go to the go to charities you know that you can trust and go to sites that you know you can trust. It's unfortunate that you have to worry about this. Where can people go to report a scam or learn more about scams? So to report a scam, you go to bbb.org slash scam tracker. And you can just call us anytime to the Better Business Bureau serving Central and South Alabama. Or you can go to give.org, as I said, to check out that particular charity. Mondi, thank you so much. Looking at this video right now, you see the utter devastation, and you know the folks there need every dollar that's intended to go their way. So we want to make sure that happens. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. And one way to make sure your donations go to those in need is by giving to our Support the Sunshine State effort. WSFA 12 News and Great Television have partnered with the Salvation Army for this campaign. Anyone who wants to donate can go to WSFA.com or text STORM to 51555. Again, WSFA.com. You should see a link at the top of the homepage or text STORM to 51555. When we come